Let's try this question once asked in G exam. Question is determine all the values of alpha for which the point alpha comma alpha square lies inside the triangle formed by the lines 2x plus 3y minus 1 is equal to 0, x plus 2y minus 3 is equal to 0 and 5x minus 6y minus 1 is equal to 0. Once again to solve this question we draw these lines on the coordinate plane. Okay, For this line x intercept is uh, uh, 1 upon 2 okay and uh, y intercept is 1 upon 3 so we have this line again we have to draw uh, these lines precisely okay this is uh, 2x plus 3y minus 1 is equal to 0. Now let's draw this line here x intercept is 3. This point okay and y intercept is 3 upon 2 1.5. So we have this point line passes through these two points okay. So let's draw this line. We have a line like this. Okay, this is straight line x plus 2y minus 3 is equal to 0. Now this straight line x intercept is 1 upon 5, very small value. Okay, and y intercept is minus 1 upon 6. 1 upon 5 is uh, here and uh, minus 1 upon 6 is here. It is uh, more close to origin very small values okay so we join these two points okay remember this is origin origin lies on this side of this straight line okay thoda karibi mamla hai to hame dhyan se draw karna hai this straight line has equation 5x minus 6y minus 1 is equal to 0 okay this line is not passing through origin. Aapko aisa lag raha hoga ki origin se pass ho rahi hai, but origin is here. It's not passing through the origin. Hai na? Now, we have to find the values of alpha for which this point lies inside this triangle. Okay. Now, there are many methods to solve this, but uh, simplest method is consider origin. Origin ko consider kare. Now, take line one by one, if we consider uh, this straight line, green straight line, 5x minus 6, 5 minus 1 is equal to 0, then uh, origin and uh, this point will lie on the same side. Origin jo hai, wo is straight line ke is taraf hai, aur ye point triangle ke andar hai, to wo bhi is taraf hoga, thik hai na? Now, with respect to origin, sign of this expression is negative so for this point also sign of this expression must be negative so we must have 5 alpha minus 6 alpha square minus 1 less than 0 this is first condition okay now we consider this straight line with respect to origin sign of this expression is negative now origin and this point lie on the same side of this straight line origin is line ke niche ki taraf hai और ये पॉइंट ट्रायंगल के अंदर है तो वो भी नीचे की तरफ ही होगा ठीक है ना सो साइन ऑफ दिस एक्सप्रेशन विद रिस्पेक्ट टू दिस पॉइंट मस्ट बी नेगेटिव सो वी हैव अल्फा प्लस टू अल्फा स्क्वायर माइनस थ्री लेस देन जीरो कंडीशन नंबर टू वी मस्ट इंपोज वन मोर कंडीशन विद रिस्पेक्ट टू दिस स्ट्रेट लाइन ठीक है ना now origin and this point lie on the opposite sides of this straight line. Origin is line ke is taraf hai aur ye point triangle ke andar jo upar ki taraf hoga. Thik hai na? Now with respect to origin sign of uh, uh, this expression is negative. So with respect to this point sign of this expression must be positive. Origin ke liye ye sign negative hai. To is point ke liye sign positive hona chahiye kyunki origin and ye point 
इस लाइन के ऑपोजिट साइड्स पे है ठीक है ना सो वी हैव टू अल्फा प्लस थ्री अल्फा स्क्वायर माइनस वन ग्रेटर देन जीरो वी हैव थ्री कंडीशन वेर वी इम्पोज ऑल दिस थ्री कंडीशन दिस पॉइंट वेल लाई इन साइड ट्राइंगल ठीक है ना ना वट वी डू वी सॉल्व दिस थ्री इन इक्वालिटीज एंड फाइंड द कॉमन सोल्यूशन ओके Let's solve the inequalities one by one. We first solve this one. We have six alpha square minus five alpha plus one greater than zero. We have factors three uh, alpha minus one multiplied by two alpha minus one greater than zero. So we have alpha less than one upon three or alpha greater than one upon two. This is uh, uh, one set of values of alpha. Okay. Now let's solve this one. We have two uh, alpha square plus alpha. We write here three alpha minus two alpha minus three less than zero. So factors are alpha minus one and two alpha plus three. This is less than zero. So we have uh, uh, minus three by two less than alpha less than one. This is second set of values of alpha. Okay. Now we solve uh, this one. We have. Three alpha square plus three alpha minus alpha minus one greater than zero. Factors are three alpha minus one multiplied by alpha plus one. This is greater than zero. So we get alpha less than minus one or alpha greater than one upon three. This is third set of values of alpha. Now we want all these three conditions uh, satisfied simultaneously. That means. Uh, We must look for common values, okay? In these three solutions, common values क्या आएंगे? The common values will be minus three upon two to minus one union one upon two to one. अब चेक करो, इन तीन सेट्स की जो common values हैं वो ये होंगे. Alpha belongs to minus three upon two to minus one union one upon two to one. ठीक है ना, so here again we are solving this question by plotting the straight lines on the coordinate plane. ठीक है ना